Cool guys, so now let's get into when you should be posting on Instagram. And as you're gonna discover here, there's no real hard and fast rules, and it actually doesn't even matter that much. Although you can get small changes in results if you optimize your post schedule and post time. So let me walk you through the best practices for posting your content on Instagram. So how often should you post is a very popular question that people ask on Instagram. And unfortunately, I can't answer this specific to your business just because it's different for every single niche depending what type of business you own and what your target audience expects from your type of business. But I can give you broad guidelines that you can work between. Posting a minimum of once a week is pretty important because you wanna make sure people know that you're still active on Instagram so people don't unfollow you or get annoyed by the lack of content that you're sharing. So I would set that at a minimum for 99% of niches, unless of course you have a specific strategy where you only wanna post super high quality things once every two weeks, that may be fine if that works for you. Maximum, there's an asterisk here because you can go over this depending on your niche and what type of Instagram account you run. But here I've written 21 times a week, which is three times a day. You really don't want to be clogging up people's news feeds and you can't maintain a high quality of post if you're posting 10 times a day because it's just impossible to do. So make sure you're posting quality stuff. You can post three, maybe four times a day. You just have to be careful that if people see you too much in their news feed and don't like what you post for that day, it's very easy for them to just quickly unfollow you so that they don't have that problem again. So I recommend posting anywhere between once a week and three times a day. I know it's broad, but test it. The best way to find out what's great for you is to test this. So post once a week to start. See what type of interaction you're getting on the media that you post and also see if your followers are coming in at the same rate. So if your account is growing at the same rate as the next week where you can test posting three times a day or twice a day or once a day and just see if it makes a change. See if people are liking your photos less or see if people are unfollowing you. And just give us some trial and error to see what works for you. If you were to start at a number, I recommend starting posting about four to five times a week. So now if you're wondering when during the week is the best time to post, you can see this graph in front of you. And basically this graph is the data from 60,000 different Instagram posts and the average amount of likes they got depending on what day that they were posted. What I draw from this graph and what I want to share with you is there really isn't that much of a difference between posting in media on any day of the week. You can see the best day as recommended by this study was Wednesday, which had an average of 4.9 likes per photo posted, where Monday was the worst day at 4.4 likes. Now this is the very best and very worst days. And as you can see, there's only a 10% difference in performance of these photos. So it's a pretty small difference. It's basically the difference between getting 18 or 20 likes in your photo. If you're only posting once a week or if you have something really important to post, I do recommend posting it on Wednesday. But just to make it easy, if there's nothing important or you're not really scheduling any big promotion or build up, I recommend not worrying about what day of the week it is, but instead looking at the time which as you can now see with the graph in front of you, there is a large variation for when the best time to post is. So by looking at this graph in front of you right now, you can see there's three really optimal times to post. And this graph is based on the same 60,000 posts as the day of the week graph that you just saw. So it's got a lot of information going into it and it's really analyzed the three best times for you to post. This graph is on Eastern Standard Time. so. Just to point out the three times, it's 2 a.m., 5 p.m., and 10 p.m. Eastern Standard Time in the USA. These three times are gonna be by far the best times for you to post your content on Instagram. I would take note of these three times and seeing how you're not gonna be posting more than three times a day, make sure when you post, it's at these times. You can, if you're posting a what are you doing now type photo, post it at any time, just Try, try to watch out between 9 a.m. and 5 p.m., which is the regular workday. There's a lot of competition for your photo to be viewed by your followers just because this is the most common time for people to post. So if you're on either side of that, you're going to have a better performing picture. If you're at either 2 a.m., 5 p.m., or 10 p.m., 
as a general rule, you're going to have the best performing picture. The last thing I wanted to reveal about when to schedule your Instagram posts is because it varies so much account to account and different business to different business, there's no really hard and fast rule for when to post. But there is this really cool tool that I go into very intricate detail on using in module six as part of the bonus apps and tricks to help boost your Instagram marketing. And it's called Iconosquare. And this is just a screenshot from it. I walk you through once again in module six. So if you want to go there after this lecture, please check it out. And what it does is it actually analyzes what time you've posted your previous Instagram pictures and the results that you got from it. So based on the size of the dot is the more interaction, which is comments and, and likes on your picture. And you can see where the bigger dots accumulate. That is when you want to be consistently posting. Once again, to get the full details on this app, go to module six, where you can see the Iconosquare walkthrough.